Sorry, Frank. I'm telling you, J.L., you're typecasting me to death. Comedy. All this comedy. Ha-ha. <laughs> yes, yes. Honest, J.L., you just gotta give me a dramatic part. Uh, hello, Mr. Hello, Leon. Well, Porky, what's on your mind? What can I do for you? You see, I've been in cartoons a long time, and, and I was thinking uh, that uh, I, I thought if, if I had a chance to act in the, the features, that, uh, that uh, we, uh, what's your old friend got that I haven't? You mean to say you want to get out of your cartoon contract? Yeah, uh, that's right. Okay, Pucky. Don't forget me when you're a star. He'll be back. Leon Schlesinger's cool helped him establish Warner Brothers' Looney Tunes and Merry Melodies as both commercial and creative successes. Since 1930, the studio's animation department has turned out the kind of work that gets special showings at places like New York's Museum of Modern Art. Artists like Frizz Freeling and Chuck Jones, or Mutt and Jeff, as J.L. Warner called them, are part of a team that won six Oscars and 27 nominations. Tex Avery, who was present at the creation, said there was only one kind of Warner Brothers cartoon, funny ones. Hello! <laughs> Porky Pig, created by Frizz Freeling in 1935, set the standards for the six-minute cartoons that became part of America's movie-going experience. Oh, don't let it worry you, Skipper. Oh, I'm just a crazy, darn fool duck. <laughs> Porky Pig's cartoons became birthplaces and proving grounds for future stars like Daffy Duck and Bugs Bunny. Got a license? Mm. Well, I haven't got one now. <laughs> the first Bugs Bunny cartoon came along as a as a, just a uh, Daffy Duck in a, in a rabbit suit, really. Bugs Bunny evolved into one of the studio's greatest megastars. He did it so quickly and explosively. You win, Doc! <laughs> I have not even begun to fight. The reason I picked that voice was I had to have a tough voice, either Brooklyn or the Bronx. So I thought, why don't I put the two of them together, Doc? So that's how I got the voice for Bugs Bunny. <laughs> Bugs hit the ground running, and he's been outwitting all kinds of varmints for over 50 years. Animators often spoofed live-action stars like Betty Davis. You think I'm cruel, mad, selfish, domineering? Good morning. Well, you're right. I'm all this and heaven, too.